Hello my dear friends, welcome back to Infigyan. In this video, we have one very very interesting question from radical mathematics. Here we have to simplify one radical expression without using a calculator. Expression is a square root of a square root of 6 power 8 plus 10 power 8 plus 16 power 6 over 2 plus 48 square. So let's get started by writing this is our expression E. Now I will simplify all the exponents separately. 6 power 8 can be written as 6 power 2 times 4. This will be equal to 6 square whole power 4 using exponent laws equal to 36 power 4. So in place of 6 power 8, we will write 36 power 4. Similarly, 10 power 8, this will be equal to 10 is square whole power 4 and 10 is square is 100. So in place of 10 power 8, we can write 100 power 4. Similarly, 16 power 6, this will be equal to 4 is square is 16, whole power is 6. We will write 4 power 2 times 6, 12. Now we can factor 12 as 3 times 4. Now we will use exponent law which will give us 4 cube whole power 4. 4 cube is 64 whole power 4. So in place of 16 power 6, we will write 64 power 4. Now the turn of 48 is square. This is equal to 48 times 48. First 48 I can factor 12 times 4. Second 48 I can factor 16 times 3. Now this will be equal to 12 times 3 times 16 times 4. 12 times 3 is 36. 16 times 4 is 64. So in place of 48 is square, we will write 36 times 64. 6 power 8 is 36 power 4. 10 power 8 is 100 power 4. And 16 power 6 is 64 power 4. Let's replace. We will write expression E equal to square root of square root of we will write here 36 power 4 plus 100 power 4 plus 64 power 4. This is our numerator. Denominator is 2. Then we have 48 a square. In this place we will write 36 times 64. Now we will consider our substitution. Let 36 equal to a, 64 equal to b. So 100 will become a plus b. And 36 times 64, here we will be writing a times b. So e will become a square root of, a square root of, we will write a power 4, 64 power 4, we will write b power 4, then 100 is a plus b, so I will write a plus b, whole power is 4, denominator is also 2. Here I will write 36 times 64 as ab. Now I will consider this is square root only equal to x. So e equal to square root of x plus ab. Where x is the square root of a power 4 plus b power 4 plus a plus b whole power 4 divided by 2. Let us simplify x first. 
So I will write here x equal to square root of a power 4 plus b power 4 plus a plus b whole power 4 divided by 2. This will be equal to the square root of a power 4 plus b power 4 plus. Now we will use binomial expansion using Pascal triangle. We know that power 4 will give us expansion coefficient 1, 4, 6, 4, 1. So I can write here a power 4 plus b power 4 for coefficient 1. For coefficient 4, I will write 4 a cube b plus 4 a b cube. And for coefficient 6, I need to write here 6 a square b square b square over 2. Now I can take the square root of a power 4 plus a power 4, b power 4 plus b power 4. So I can write here 2a power 4 plus 2b power 4 plus 4a cube b plus 4ab cube plus 6a square b square and denominator is 2. Now we can take 2 common from the numerator and cancel with denominator 2. So we will get square root of I will write a power 4 only plus b power 4 plus 2a cube b plus 2ab cube plus 3a square b square. Now we will split 3a square b square as a square b square plus 2a square b square. So I will write the square root of a power 4 plus b power 4 plus a square b square plus 2a square b square. This is 3a square b square plus 2ab cube plus 2a cube b. Now we have to only write in this manner. a power 4 we will write a square whole square. b power 4 we will write b square whole square. a square b square we will write ab whole square. Then we have term 2a square b square which we will write 2 times a square times b square plus 2a b cube. We will write 2 times a b times b square or 2 times b square times a b plus 2 times a b times a square. Now you can see and compare with our standard algebraic identity a plus b plus c whole square. If this is a, this is b as per formula. Let's say p, q, r. So p is a square, q is b square, r is a, b. Then this is 2 p, q, 2 q, r. And last term is 2 times r, p or p, r. So this radicand will be equal to a square plus b square plus ab whole square. Let me write here x equal to square root of a square plus b square plus ab whole square. Now square root and square is there. We will cancel both. And we will write x will be equal to a square plus b square plus ab. So our required expression e will become a square root of x plus ab. So this will be equal to a square root of x is a square plus b square plus ab. Then we have plus ab. So I can write the square root of 
a square plus b square plus twice ab. This is one algebraic formula. So here we can write a plus b whole a square. Now a square root and a square will be over. We will write expression equal to a plus b. Now a was 36, b was 64. So we can find our final answer e equal to a plus b. a was 36, b was 64. We can write our answer will become 100 without using a calculator. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye bye.